Hello, thanks for stopping by. My name is David Rogo. I own and operate a catering business here in San Diego called Dinners by David. Today I'm going to show you a very simple recipe that's easy to make and equally as tasty. Macadamia nut and crusted sea bass. As you can see, we have our sea bass fillets, seasoned breadcrumbs, macadamias, eggs, a lemon, and some flour. We'll also need a little kosher salt and lemon pepper to season the fish, as well as some olive oil and butter when we're ready to pan saute. So first, let's season the fillets with a little bit of kosher salt and lemon pepper. Next, we'll set up a breading station with flour, eggs, breadcrumbs, and crushed macadamias. To crush the macadamias, we'll place them in a food processor. If you don't have a processor, grab a rolling pin or something similar and pound by hand. If you choose to do it this way, be sure to completely wrap the macadamias in foil or a heavy-duty plastic bag before pounding to prevent a big mess. Then simply pound the macadamias until they're crushed into small pieces. Once all the macadamias are prepped, set up your production line in the following order. Flour, well-beaten eggs, breadcrumbs, more eggs, then the crushed macadamias. Instead of combining both the breadcrumbs and the macadamias together, I like to coat each one separately, creating a nice crisp crust with lots of macadamia nut flavor. So when ready, roll each fillet one by one into each ingredient to complete the coat. Into the flour, then the egg wash, then into the breadcrumbs, back into the egg wash, and then into the macadamias. And then once all your fillets are breaded, we'll heat a medium sized saute pan with the butter and olive oil. When it's hot, add the fillets, cook for about two minutes on each side till we get a nice golden brown crisp crust. We'll then take the fish, Finish them off in a 375 degree oven for about 5 to 7 minutes until just cooked. Don't overcook your fish. Remove the fish from the oven, place onto a dinner plate alongside some basmati rice and fresh asparagus. Pair this with a bottle of your favorite Sauvignon Blanc and you've got a complete meal you can be proud of for any occasion. Well that's it for today. Thanks for watching. I'm David Rogo and whether it's casual dinner for friends or a private catered event called Dinners by David for life's special occasions. See you soon.